Okay. How's it going, guys? Connor is here. Welcome back to some more Pokemon Floral Tempest. In the last episode, we uh, went on Route A. We got to Lilium City. We battled one of our rivals, Faye. Whooped her ass. And uh, yeah, now we're here at the Lilium Ranch where we got to give this guy an antidote, which we already have. So let's go ahead and give it to him. I have one. Oh, do I need to get like a special antidote? God damn it. Thought he just wanted an antidote. I have an antidote. Okay, I'm guessing we need like a special antidote, like one for a fever. God damn it, when he said antidote, I thought he meant, you know, a fucking antidote. Ugh. Alright. Well, that didn't work. They didn't think we were gonna have to come all the way back. Alright, well, guess we'll go to Lilium City. I guess we'll check it out while we're there. Might as well. We'll check this place out, see what it has to offer. Hello, sir. Okay, interesting. Hmm, sounds suspicious. Yep, this game does have uh, regions one or Pokemon from regions one through seven. So, yep, that's pretty cool. All types of Pokemon. This kitty gives you a weird look. What the hell's wrong with you, Skitty? Why are you looking at me weird? Jesus. It's not cool, Skitty. Yes, I can go inside this. So the greenhouse? Oh, it's Faze over there. <laughs> what, a guy can't enjoy some flowers? What's up, Mark? Didn't know that all the towns in this region are named after flowers? Pretty neat, huh? I guess so. That's something I definitely did not know about. The floral department. Okay, we got the Whalmer Pale, then we got berries on top of berries on top of berries. A spray duck. Okay. Nothing I really need right now, just a shit ton of berries. Where the hell am I supposed to get this antidote at? want to buy a super potion for my boy Young Raichu, but they're out of stock. My boy Young Raichu. Oh my god. What'd you say? Okay. Where's the Gatorade? What's up, kid? You look down. Taros of the Ranch is sick. Well, say no more. I got what you need. Secret antidote. Okay, yeah, we needed a special antidote. Alright, while I'm here, I might as well buy some potions. Need my four grand. Let's also buy some regular antidotes, just in case we need them. 
We have 20 Pokeballs, so we probably won't need any more for a good while. Alright. Apparently you can't go in that building. It's a big ass building, dude. Holy shit. Look at that one, two, three, four, five, six stories. God damn. Okay, so there's an exit there. I want to check out the rest of this place before we head back to the ranch. <laughs> I got supreme Pokeballs. We ain't got shit on me. Kid's a fucking savage. Dory, you can't stay holed up in there. You can't just ignore every gym battle. Sigh. Oh. Hey, are you looking to battle the gym leader by any chance? The name's Garrison. I am the assistant of the town's gym leader. Or maybe it would be who I would be if the gym leader in this town would do her job. Of course. Anyway, what's your name? Yo, Mark. Who's your friend? I'm Garrison. I'm the assistant of the gym leader for the town. Why does a gym leader need an assistant? It's complicated. I'd rather not explain. Alright, so when can I battle the gym leader? Probably not anytime soon. Lately, the gym leader of this town uh, has been losing a lot. She beats herself up over it and ends up locking herself up in that tower. Well, she's the first gym leader. Of course she's going to get whooped a lot. I would hate to be the first gym leader of a region. Just get your ass whooped day in and day out. Sigh. So if you want to battle the gym leader, you're going to have to come back at a different time. Ah, that sucks. What kind of gym leader gets mad when they lose? Ugh. Sorry about all this. It's not your fault. It's just that this gym leader sounds like the biggest crybaby ever. Damn. Savage. Oh my god, is it a little girl? Is she like a little 10 year old or something? Holy shit. Uh, Dory? Oh, <laughs> she fucking ran off! Sigh. Yep, big crybaby indeed. Let me guess, we have to help you find her? I didn't say anything. I'd feel really guilty after calling her a crybaby. I think it's better if we help out. I guess help would be nice. She usually runs off like this a lot. Finding her alone is a pain. I'll go ask around, see if anyone see, saw where she ran off to. Thanks for the help. Again, I'm really sorry about all this. I know how much you guys are looking forward to a gym battle. She shouldn't ever be running off like this. Kidnappers could be anywhere. Anyway, here, take these. They'll be really helpful. Three orange berries. Random as shit. Knowing her, she probably ran off toward Route B. She really loves the flowers there. I'm gonna go searching. Let me know if you see her. Okay. Oh, it's the this guy. Oh wait, no, never mind. I thought this was like a thief or something. Guess is not. All right, so here's the gym. I don't know what type of gym it is. I would love that there was a sign out front that told me what type this gym was. Really helpful. Hello. You want a powerful Pokemon? Beat the gym leader of this town, then come back to me. I'll give you something clean. Holy shit, alright. I'll, I'll take your word for it. Watch it be some shit Pokemon. Can I have this Growlithe? <laughs> Stares deep into your soul. What are you doing in my house? This man just gave me some light clay. Alright. I didn't, I didn't know you had light clay, but I'll gladly take it. really need any of that right now. Alright, so looks like we're done checking out everything here in Lilium City. So Route B, I don't know where that's at. I'm guessing it's over here to the right. But we're not going to deal with any of that right now. We're going to go back to the ranch. I'm going to give that one dude his uh, secret antidote. See what we can get in return. I also got to check out the rest of the ranch. really don't want to fight those grass type Pokemon trainers. Really don't want to do it right now. So then we can get like a Pokemon or something from over here. I'm not sure if it's from this guy over here with a Tauros. 
Oh shit, I thought she was gonna walk my direction. Alright. Got your antidote. Looks like you have the antidote. Just go spray that on Toros and that should fix him up real good. Okay, I'm not sure if we, uh... We wanna make sure we rest here. Where the hell is Toros even at? Probably up north somewhere. Alright, you are right there. I'm gonna try to get past you without you looking at me. Alright. What the hell is this? Mill? How's a Mareep? Hi, Mareep. Got a paralyzed heal. What kind of Pokemon are in here? Oh, it's a Skiddo. If we can, we can get a Skiddo if we want. I don't really know if I want a Skiddo. It doesn't really help with my grass weakness. We could teach it Bulldoze, though. There's definitely something we could teach the Skiddo. I'm guessing that's the Tauros right there. Cutie Fly. Hmm. We already have a fairy when Bubsy evolves. So really no need for that. Tortor? Is that not the Tauros? Came all the way over here for a potion. Tortor? Trying to look at what else we got here. Oh my god! Is that a shiny Petalil? Is that motherfucker shiny? Hold on, what? Is this a shiny Petalil? Am I looking at a fucking shiny right now? It didn't make like the sparkle, but it's obviously not supposed to be fucking pink. Yo. We just found ourselves a shiny fucking Petalil. That is game. That is fucking game. I've never used a pedal in a playthrough before. Pretty sure. It's pretty sure this thing's also pure grass. That'll be nice. A little pure grass lilligant. Yo. You know what? Since ours is pink, I'm gonna name him Pink. Pinky. Pinky with an eye. <laughs> Don't ask me why. That rhymed. So that motherfucker shiny? It is a shiny fucking petal, little dude. That is crazy. It has own tempo, which prevents it from becoming confused. It's absorbing growth. Okay. I kind of want to use it just because it's fucking shiny. That is wild. Oh, that's the Tauros we needed to spray. Nothing happens, apparently. So, did the antidote work? Tauros still looks angry. Tor! really wonder what's gotten into Tauros' skin. Tauros shifts uncontrollably. Well, looks like I'll have to call up the professor. Can I have the Tauros? It's a needle stuck in Tauros's fur. Oh shit, pull it out? Sure. A fucking razor fang. Uh, Tor Tor. Tauros jumps around joyfully. Tor Tor. Hey, looks like you found what was aching Tauros. Ha ha ha. All this time it was a tiny little fang. And here I was thinking it was much more than that. Why don't you come down to my uh, home? That way I can thank you properly. Tortor. Okay. Cottony. Alright. Let me go. Does this guy down here want to fight? God damn it. I was trying to see if this guy right here wants to fight real quick. Holy shit, it's a pine co. Those things tend to explode. So, uh, I don't want anything to do with it. 
I don't want nothing to do with the pine cow. You could, I could find Pumpkaboo in the grass. Holy shit, dude. I kind of want a Pumpkaboo. Now that he said that, I kind of want a Pumpkaboo. Nidoran would help me with my, uh, my grass weak... Actually, yeah, Nidoran would definitely help me with my grass weakness. But I feel like I used Nidoran a lot. I used one recently, I think. Used a Nidoran fairly recently. Was it in Conspiracy? Or Unbound? It was in a recent playthrough I had a Nidoran, so I don't want to use another one. Pidgey! Oh, wait. Uh, Pidgey's too common. I want to look around a little more. Nah, I don't think. I don't think we'll get anything that awesome. Let's just dip. Try not to fight her. No! Why? How... How do you have great eyesight? <laughs> Why is your eyesight that good? God damn it. <laughs> Fuck. Shit, dude. I was not expecting her to have amazing eyesight. Oh, we got the crit on Cherubi. Holy shit. Alright, Bubsy. Try to take out this Badoo. You and me, buddy. We'll water gun it to heck. It looks, damn, dude. It looks like about six water guns to get it down. Fuck. Yeah, nope. Switch. Might have to growth absorb with Pinky. Shit, it's already growthing. No. Let's heal. This is not going to be good. How much does that do? How much? Four? Okay, it's only growth once, I think. So with this one, we are now tied... I'm now one up. It's only doing four damage a hit right now. So we've growth twice, it growth once. Okay, it's just hitting absorbs. As long as we just keep growthing. We're up three right now. See how much damage we're doing with three. We are doing zero damage with three growths. It is four times not very effective because this thing's fucking poison grass. But fuck, dude, really? No damage. Zero fucking damage. Oh, that is lame. Ah. Uh. Why, oh why, oh why. There's gonna be no point to be doing this. I'm gonna get to max, and I'm gonna be doing like fucking one damage. Because it's four times not very effective. This thing's poison grass. I'm already at the peak. Let's see what my hard work does. My hard work gets me nothing. Absolutely no damage. I get one HP back. One. Fucking one. Oh my god. The only other, I mean the only thing I think of right now is just letting him use up all his absorbs. Absorb has 25 PP though. It's a lot of PP. And he got a crit. That's not going to help. Him getting a crit is not helping. Can't I get a crit? Look at that. I've maxed out my special attack, and it does that much damage. My special attack is maxed out right now. 
six growths, and that's what it shows. That's how much my hard work shows. Fucking hell. This is ridiculous, dude. That's all I get. That's it. I just gotta hope I can stall him out a bit. Once he runs out of absorbs, he can't really hit me anymore. I don't think he has any other attacking moves. Just has growth and water sport. Let's see, how much do we have? We have 18, so he has at least less than us, because we've wasted six turns of growthing, so he has, like, at maximum 12 left. 11, 12, at max. Come on. Stall for the win. Stall for the fucking win. Let's go. Come on. Run out of absorbs. Please. I'm begging you. Come on, Badoo. You know you want to. I got a crit. I got a fucking crit. It only did like 5%. I'm gonna heal because I'm not I'm not gonna risk him critting me and killing me. That'll just ruin everything. Pinky has to keep going until he runs out of absorbs. Come on. Run out of absorbs. Please. I'm begging you, Badoo. I'm fucking begging you. Come on. Come on, Badoo. Run out. Arrgh. This is fucking annoying. This is fucking annoying. I gotta heal. Can't risk a crit. I really can't. I don't even know how much a crit will do. I think a crit will do like 10 or some shit like that. Did he run out? I'm gonna wait a little longer because he might just be playing me. He might be playing me. I'll wait three turns. If he doesn't absorb in three turns, then I'll just suspect he's run out. So that's one. If he doesn't use absorb two more turns, I'll just expect him to, to have run out. Two. I'm trying to play this as safe as fucking possible. If he doesn't use Absorb here, then he's run out. Okay. Look, he's run out. He's done. He's out of Absorbs. We're good. Let's switch back to Popolio. Let's get this W. Okay. So that was, that was how we lived that. We literally just stalled out for 25 turns while he ran out of Absorbs. If he absorbs me right now, I'm gonna be fucking pissed. <laughs> it's like, ah, gotcha, bitch. All right, let's take him out now. Yep, we're good. Ah, there we go. That took us that much to beat a fucking Badoo. Ah, I didn't like that. Did not like that one bit, but at least we got it done. All right, well, because of that long-ass battle with the Badoo, before we go ahead and talk... Actually, no, we'll just talk to him now. Fuck it. I was going to end it, but no, nah, let's just talk to him. Then we'll end it. Wow, I really didn't bother to even check around Tauros for small stuff like that. Shows I still have a lot to learn. Ha ha ha. Here, have this. A Pokemon egg. Nice. Again, thank you so much for helping us out. I'll tell the professor about your help here today. He'll be really pleased to know you helped me out. 
Also, hope that egg proves useful to you in the future. I'll take a fucking egg, dude. Nice. Alright. Let's get healed up. And yeah, with that being said, guys, it is now time for us to end the episode. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more Spin Con Artist. I'll uh, see you guys next time. We'll probably look around, fight the rest of the trainers here. Uh, I'll probably hatch this egg off screen, then we'll see what it is at the beginning of the next episode. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more Spin Con Artist. I'll see you guys next time with some more Pokemon Floral Tempest. Thanks for watching again, and uh, yeah, peace out.